Hey Sam, are you going to work at the nuclear power plant during their outage in three weeks? Uh, yes, Joe. I'm going there tomorrow for training. I guess I'll see you tomorrow. No, I won't be going there until two days before the outage starts. Don't you have to go earlier for site-specific task training and evaluations? My employer had me take industry task evaluations in advance called EPRI-STEs. I'm going to be working at another site, performing the same tasks until the outage starts. Are you able to perform the same work for two organizations without site-specific task training and evaluation? Yes. The industry task evaluations, known as STEs, enable supplemental workers to go from site to site without being re-evaluated. Okay. I guess I'll see you during the outage. You bet. The EPRI Standardized Task Evaluation Program, or STE, is designed to evaluate a worker on a specific task, such as a maintenance task, to contribute to a work-ready workforce. Utilities can use the evaluation tools in the EPRI STE program to streamline the qualification of maintenance workers. The tools are uniform testing modules that verify a worker's knowledge and skills. The EPRI STEs can be used in several different ways, including evaluation of a worker prior to arrival on site. The worker is able to start sooner instead of undergoing site-specific evaluation. Additionally, a utility can accept a worker that was evaluated by another organization. This is facilitated using the EPRI STE Completion Registry. In both of these examples, the worker arrives on site ready to work, contributing to a work-ready workforce. Use of workers who have completed an STE increases confidence that the workers can do the assigned job and contributes to the effective performance of maintenance tasks. In collaboration with program members, EPRI has developed standardized task evaluations for more than 80 common industry tasks, such as perform standard rigging, use of basic testing equipment, and general valve maintenance. STEs are developed by subject matter experts using the Systematic Approach to Training, or SAT method. Each STE consists of three components a task analysis and corresponding objectives, a written examination to assess worker knowledge, and a performance evaluation, or practical, to verify skills. EPRI maintains an STE task list, which is a prioritized list of industry-identified high-priority tasks. Within the program, new STEs are being developed, and existing STEs are reviewed and revised as necessary to meet current industry needs. STEs are administered by a utility or workforce provider who has demonstrated compliance with EPRI program administrative guidelines. These guidelines, called the Administration Protocol for Portable Practicals, referred to as AP3, consist of attributes that a workforce provider must meet to be compliant. EPRI STE program members have access to an EPRI maintained online completion registry which contains the names of those who have satisfactorily completed knowledge and performance evaluations. Members use the information from the completion registry to help determine qualification of an individual for a given task. Through membership in the EPRI STE program, utilities and workforce providers can achieve increased ability for workers to go directly to work, improved work quality and consistency during task performance, and significant reductions in training and in processing costs. Good to see you, Sam. How were the task training and evaluations you received before the outage? It was good. However, I already knew the material. I'm going to ask my employer about EPRI STEs. Great idea. I like being able to come to the plant ready to go to work. For more information about how your organization can benefit from the EPRI STE program, visit www epri.com or contact the EPRI Customer Service Center at askepri at epri.com.